Hello, thanks for joining us. I'm Scott with the Garmin Aviation Team, and this is the Flightstream 510 Wireless Gateway Card. Today, we're going to look at some of the ways this little connectivity device can team with the Garmin Connects platform in your G1000 NXI Integrated Flight Deck to help save you time and workload, both inside and outside of the cockpit. The Flightstream 510 is a patented multimedia card that contains Wi-Fi and Bluetooth connectivity capability. What it does is enable you to stream information in real time between your G1000 NXI avionics system and compatible mobile devices running our Garmin Pilot app. There's no complex wiring or installation required. The Flightstream 510 plugs easily into one of the data slots on your G1000 NXI display bezels. And once installed, the Flightstream 510 can be wirelessly connected with up to two compatible Apple or Android mobile devices in your cockpit, as well as our Garmin Era 660 or Era 795-796 series portables. It can also provide flight plan transfer and some additional data display options on compatible devices running the ForeFlight mobile app. Essentially, the Flightstream 510 turns your tablet or smartphone into a true cockpit interface, enabling you to pull together and access numerous sources of information coming from your avionics system. For example, it allows you to more easily manage your database subscriptions and uploads, while also enabling wireless flight plan transfer, plus sharing of traffic, weather, WAS GPS, AHARS data, and more with the Garmin Pilot app on your mobile device. To see how all that can help streamline your cockpit management, let's imagine that we're taking a flight from Columbia, South Carolina to Raleigh, North Carolina. So, here you are on your iPad the night before your flight. You start checking the weather, planning your route, filing your flight plan. You check to see if there are any database updates for your avionics that you need to download and you collect all that information on your iPad. Then, next day when you go out to the airport, you've got everything all set up to go. You turn on the master switch, and while you're outside doing your walk around inspection, your wireless database concierge connection is automatically uploading your database updates. Your navigation base map, obstacles, safe taxi diagrams, flight charts, the whole works. See they're all getting updated wirelessly from the iPad. So once you acknowledge the completed transfer, all your databases are updated and you're ready to go. Not only does your wireless connection update your primary GPS navigation system, but through a process called database synchronization, it also pushes that database update to all of the flight displays in your G1000 NXI system. One upload, one link seeks everything up. It's as easy as that. Okay, now that your databases are updated, let's load up that flight plan that you created last night on your iPad. You can check to see if you've received any modifications to your flight plan routing from ATC, which you can choose to enter manually, or better yet, opt to have the changes accepted automatically. Then, if everything looks good, you're ready to just press the Connects button here on the Garmin Pilot flight plan page and send it across to your G1000 NXI avionics. A message pops up here, the new flight plan comes up, and you're all set to fly your route from Columbia, South Carolina, doing the Buzzy 6 arrival into Raleigh-Durham. You hit activate, and now that's our active flight plan. So you're all set to taxi out with an absolute minimal amount of pre-flight knob twisting and data entry. And if you'd like some in-flight entertainment, you can add a subscription to SiriusXM and use your iPad with the cabin audio to wirelessly access 150 plus channels of music and programming from any seat in your aircraft. Less work, more enjoyment, improved pilot efficiency. The Garmin Flightstream 510 makes it all possible. If you'd like to learn more, visit our website, garmin.com or see your Garmin dealer. Thanks for watching.